And then after that, I think we should just, just, just... Let's just take a break from trying that. It's getting to my head. Uh, why don't we do some flag painting? Flag painting is fun. Flag painting is fun, right, guys? Um... Just to make sure. So let's record down the old orthodox percent that way because, you know, I have an analog. Shouldn't be any Coptic, but... Um... GFX... Flags. Alright, um... No, this is before I screwed it up. Explains where we got the whole no relig giant chunk of no religion stuff. Damn, damn, damn. I just want to know why I didn't properly map. That's the thing. Should have properly. Then should have mapped, right? Well, now that I look at it, it's pretty obvious as to why it didn't map. I'm a dumbass. I am a dumbass. I am a dumbass. Dum dum dumbass. Da 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 dumbass. Dum da dumbass. And that'll fix it. <sighs> and that was the sound of me just dropping something I was holding, because I'm a dumbass. I'm a dumbass. Alright, so let's search up Ethiopian flag. E-T-H. Alright, here we go. This gives me Ethiopia Republic... Let's just open up all five, since we're going to need to modify all five. In the meantime, while that opens, let's uh, quickly boot up the old converter again. Try one more time. I'm, I'm sure we'll get it right. Whilst paint.net opens in the background. Paint.net is, by the way, free, and you can download it wherever. And good way of modifying stuff. So, that's the monarchy. Okay. So, this is the Republic flag. And this is... Yeah, Republic flag. I don't know what the base flag is. I'll just close that one for now. This is the monarchy flag, the communist flag, and the fascist flag bases. All right. So with that, those are the main four that we'll have to deal with. Um, now I just need to search my images. Hang on. Come on here. Over here. Oop. Um, let me just search up through my images here. Let's see. What did I do with my palm urinate flag? Yeah, I've got Tropico in my drive right now. Quiet, you. Uh, I've just had it in there forever because it requires CD authentication. As if we're not in an era where we didn't need that. God. Yeah, I have no idea where I put it. Uh, so we'll just do the next logical thing. Crusader Kings 2. GFX. Flags. Empire underscore la Latin Empire dot TGA. Let's open that up. Oh, damn it! I updated the game since I ended the vector campaign so oh so long ago. So damn it, I guess we'll have to use E3. The tricolor is always glassy. Um, very true. 
prefix flags ETH. And Gaiden's sending me a file. That's a PNG. I'm just going to take a wild guess and assume that this is the flag. <laughs> Here's a question, why the freak do you have a copy of this? This better not be porn. Yep, it's porn. Art stylings of Caden, one of my moderators, who has me on Skype and decided to send me that randomly. Yeah, I, I don't know. They look like urinals. I, I agree with you. Uh, and this is why you're not an artist, Caden. So, here's the thing. Uh, this is 64 by 64. 93 by 64. Okay. So that means this just needs to be extended on both sides to be made into a flag. Um, let's see. Where's my calculator? Oh, calculator! Uh, so, 93 minus 64. 29 divided by 2. What? Let's try that again. 93... Minus 64 divided by 2. 14.5, okay. So, hmm. 14, well, I guess we'll have to make it 14 on one side, 15 on another. Oh, well, can't perfectly center it. Um, so, we'll need to extend this. Then we'll use this first. Zoom in, so it's easier to tell. Oh wait, we can just use expand canvas, can't we? Canvas size. Width. Mm, okay, center it. And upgrade to 93. There we are. Alright, so... Uh, let's do this, and do this, and this. Um, hmm. Well, the Lighthouse of Alexandria would have no reason not to exist. It was built thousands of years before I took it over. And I don't think there'd be any reason for me to burn it down. So, sure, why not? Yeah, it still exists. <laughs> Alright, so here we go. We've got the base lag. I think this will do for just the monarchy. Um... It's true, no lack of funding to maintain it. We, we've got that, and we always had high culture. So, you know, that proves we, we, we took care of stuff. Um, yeah, I'm just debating. What do we do with the flag, though? Uh, what, did, what did Ethiopia do? Weird swirly crap. That's actually kind of cool. Eh, that's a monarchy flag, alright. Um... I don't know. Uh, I guess that'll do for the monarchy flag. What 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 should we? What should we do for the, the weird swirly thing? The communism is red. Fascism is dark blue. Uh, isn't fascism black? I'm pretty sure. Can you put the eagle on the tricolor? I suppose I theoretically could. Yes. Um, hang on. Magic wand it. Tolerance, eh. delete, there we go, isolated the eagle, um, and select, control C, control V, oh no wait, we need to make a new layer, new layer, uh, and then paste it. That's what the eagle on the tricolor looks like.
Fascism replace the spear with the right way. It's not great. What if we change the tricolor or something, though? Uh, this, this could be a good republic flag. Um, well, no. We want a tolerance much less than... What? Why is that... Oh, because we're still in layer 2, that's why, okay. Um... Alright, uh, I'm gonna drop this back over on here, so that way I don't lose that color, because of anything. Uh, let's up the tolerance, 50% should do. Good. Um, let's darken up the red a bit. I don't know if I like the red there. Um... That looks okay. Um, we, we don't want more red because of the spear. And we can't use yellow. A darker blue. Uh, and a dark green. What would a, whoops, what would a dark yellow look like? Hmm. Although this is kind of close. Let's look at it from a distance. Hmm. Yeah, that does not look good. Um, good in concept, I suppose, but I don't think that this is going to necessarily work. Um... Black on top and bottom with something else in the middle. Okay. Let's try that. Um, black on the top and the bottom. And can we use the purple in the middle? Or does that uh, mix with the black too badly? Well, uh, we could up, up it a little. Oops. Here we go. Um... much tolerance. Hmm. I like it, yeah. I, I, I could I could dig this. This is this has gotta be the fascist flag. Done. Here we go. Oh one fla fascist flag. GFX. Uh, no, we still want to go into flags here, but we want to rename you to Ethiopia fascist. Uh, yeah, let's just go with this as the fascist flag. Except I saved it as the wrong type, didn't I? Whoops. Save as Ethiopia fascist. I don't want to paint on that. I want a TGA. Yep, that's good. Save in the highest quality. Flatten. That is fine. Well, we have the fascist flag open now. Um, let me uh, go back to the flags in Victoria 2 and reopen the Republic flag. Did I really? Oh, man. I'll fix that. Hang on. Flags. Uh... Search ETH. Okay, we delete you. Rename you to FASC. Okay, I have to delete the old one. Done. Okay. Um, no, I've got something else for the communist idea, I think. Um, well, we'll see. We will see. Um, alright, so yeah, that's the fascist flag. Just to make sure it's uh, proper now. Yeah, okay, good. Uh, and open up the republic flag again. Alright, so that's the base flag here. Um, alright, so... 
That'll do for the fascist flags. It's quite nice. Um, yeah, this is the monarchy flag. Uh, the base one, I think, is okay for the monarchy, right? Give the eagle a crown. Good god. Alright, well, let's see if I can make a crown that isn't shit. <laughs> and there you have it, a crown. <laughs> mm -hmm. I don't know. That's about the best I can do for a crown. Yes, everyone feel free to insult my art skills. I never tried to be an artist. Though, if I wanted to do it, actually... I would invert the crown, so it's like so. Looks a little better, I think. Yes. Yeah, I, I like that. That, that. That's okay for the uh, monarchy flag. Um, right, I need to save problem, because this is still over in EU3. Yes, it is. So we'll head back up here. Common. Uh, Victoria 2. GFX, flags. It's Ethiopia Monarchy. Yes. I believe that should do it. Yes. Alright, so I spelt it right. It's asking me to replace it, I definitely spelt it right. Good. So that's the Monarchy flag, which means we can simply close you. So we got the Monarchy flag, we got the Fascist flag. We now just need a republic and a communist flag. Um... Hmm... Well, when in doubt, to Google. Cause I... 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 Hammer... I'm thinking kind of, uh, like, having, uh, the bird wielding a hammer or sickle and having the other one, like, up here or something. Uh, let's go to Google and tell them. Hammer and sickle. Maybe I'll have some images I can use. No hammers or sickles. Alright. East German style. Alright, let's take a look at that. Hmm. Not bad. Why is everyone so... It is... Replace the cross with a red star. I'm gonna need a base one to work with, so... I have to get rid of the crown. Um, just remember not to save this. Alright. Replace that with a red star. Red star. I... I guess. Alright. Uh, first though, let's get a sample of you. And paint over this thing. Polish, polish, polish. Do -do. There we are. Scratch out the cross. And give her a smudge on my screen while I'm at it. Alright, there we are. Yeah. What is the job of the majority of workers in the Palmyrene Empire? Let's take a look at that. 
Speaking of which, I have that new output, don't I? Easy to pick two. I have a whole new output that I need to put into the save file, don't I? If you'll excuse me for a moment. Let's toss that in the save file. Yeah, the symbol of the working class. We'll see in a moment. Um, just let me... Oh, need to get down another level. There we are. And move in replace. There we are. All right. And now we get back to the grand campaign. And let that load. <laughs> All right. Try that again. Um... Do do Um alright. And by hell it's farmers. Yeah, by, by majority it's farmers. Pitchfork, eh? She Alright, a pitchfork. Um, okay. Cheek it out here. No, uh, that didn't, that select didn't work. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Let's just, let's just not. <laughs> uh, let's sue select. Where's like custom select? Is there no like custom freeform shape? There we go. Scratch everything I just tried to do. Oh uh, boy. Um. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Yeah, I guess I'll have to do it with the lip select. Well, I want to try and make it as small as I possibly... I guess that'll have to do. Yep, that'll do. So that way it doesn't interfere too much, I hope. And... Then we grab a couple. Come on, I'd like to be able to draw here. Oh, I still have the ellipse select. Whoops. There we go. I always forget how this program works. Do do do. Do do. And there we go. We can change color as, as needed. Alright, so we've got a nice pitchfork now. Turn the <laughs> or a tri spear. Yeah, certainly how it worked. Um, red star. Layers. Uh, do we, do we, is there any like easy, just make a star thing? No, I guess not. Um, excuse me, to Google. Although, bajillion pixels, it'll do, I think. What's the smallest size they have? 95 by 95? All right. I'll take it. Thank you, Google, for offering me smaller sized images. 
Let's drop in my pictures folder. Oh yeah, while we're while I do that, let's uh, real quick here uh, load in. I want to ch check here. Uh, did it work by chance? Huzzah! Yay! We are 84.7% Coptic now, as opposed to no religion. Hoorah! <laughs> and from there I can change the, uh, you know, the symbol and all that. So, it'll at least work. It will work. Take that for, you know, its face value. It'll work. Uh, anyway, um... Add layer. And I don't by default have the select tool. Screw you two. Okay, so we'll just open it in another one then. Control C, Control V, keep the canvas size. 